Hey guys, uh, I shot this video yesterday, it was nine minutes long and I couldn't upload it, so uh, I'm gonna have another crack at it and just talk a little bit quicker um, and cut some stuff out of it. Hopefully uh, this information is going to be of use to you. Uh, most of this information comes from uh, Dr. Jason West from the West Clinic in Idaho. He's, uh, he's got a fantastic uh, website if you wanna go and just check that out. He's got a heap of information there. Um, most of the information the, from the medical professionals and the government at the moment is more about limiting exposure. Um, this is important, don't get me wrong. But what we want to try and do is give you some active uh, information here that will boost your immunity. We're all going to be exposed um, to this virus one way or another, or a lot of us probably already have. Um, and it'll be the difference between um, getting well and, you know, uh, ultimately getting quite unwell. Um, the thing that is going to stop us from doing that is our immune system. All this, uh, all this information is kind of, um, you know, it's com common sense a lot of it. Uh, but I will give you the vitamin recommendations at the end, which are more specific. Um, the irony is that everyone's run out and got pasta, sugar, and flour. I don't know what they're going to do with it all. But uh, if you go to the, the supermarkets at the moment at least, uh, fresh fruit and veg is widely available. And you are what you eat. Uh, your immune system is vastly affected by what you eat. There's a little uh, Dr. Jason West, I didn't know this actually when he mentioned it, it's an amazing um, statistic, but if you eat a spoonful of sugar, a teaspoonful of sugar, 30 minutes later your white blood cells are four times less effective for shooting off bad, bad things such as bacteria and, um, and viruses. So, um, you know, try to limit your you know, consumption of sugar. Uh, but also just eat healthy. Just keep doing exercise as much as you can. We're going to be going down into lockdown soon, so exercise is vitally important. Get out while you can. Um, we went to Taekwondo and my daughter did gymnastics yesterday. Um, you know, when you're at home, don't be sitting around just watching Netflix. Make sure that you're getting out, um, even into your backyard. If you can't go into your backyard, doing some exercise inside because it makes a massive difference to your immune system. I also wanted to let you know that I've been speaking to a patient on Thursday who works for Coles and he was saying that all their supply chains are, chains are unaffected as far as food goes. There's heaps of food for everyone, they're not going to run out of food. The only problem is if everyone keeps on panic buying, uh, we're going to run out of packaging because all that packaging comes from China. But uh, there's plenty of food, we're not going to starve through this, uh, this situation we find ourselves in. Um, this situation I reckon is only gonna last for two to three months and then we'll all go back to normal more or less there you know um, now prepping your body specifically what you need to do uh, good food good water in order of uh, importance as far as vitamins go vitamin C the most important one 2,000 3,000 milligrams a day zinc 10 to 15 milligrams a day uh, D3 vitamin D3 10,000 international units depending on what you do Vitamin A, uh, around 10,000 international units. Please note that that can interact uh, with your um, your um, your drugs or uh, medicines that you may be taking. So please make sure that you uh, speak to your doctor about that. Uh, fatty acids, vitamin three, six, and nine, really important. About two to four hundred milligrams a day. Multivitamins, if you've got them, take them. Don't let them just sit in your cupboard not being used. Um, they will all boost your immunity and reduce your risk factors. Remember, a lot of people are getting infected and a lot of people are recovering. You want to be one of those people if you do, in fact, get infected. Um, our naturopath, uh, Karen's doing online consults. She can make recommendations. You're gonna to have to speak to her. This is not my area, but colloidal silver, echinacea, alderberry, all fantastic. Remember, heaps of people are getting infected, as I said before, um, eat well, exercise, take vitamins, and more importantly than um, probably all those is don't stress you know only stress about the things that you've got um, control over um, a lot of the things we don't in this situation we're a little bit um, we're like passengers so keep focused and we'll speak to you soon